action. Hi guys, it's Brittany. I'm a part-time reseller and I know it's been a little while since I've been on, but I've been really, really, really busy with buying a lot of items. This is some of the stuff that I just recently listed, so I thought I would do a short video. And I have my little helper here, Riley. Stop it. Okay. Um, so we'll start with this bag. Um, first item I have is a pair of Doc Martens. This one here is the Jadon style. And I believe... Okay, yeah, I ended up listing those for $80. I paid $40 for it. But after I got home, I realized there's a little defect right here. I don't know if you can see. So I went ahead and marked them down. So hopefully they sell for $80 and then maybe I'll make $30 profit possibly. Okay, the next pair I have is called, I've never bought this pair of shoes yet. Um, called John Barbatos. Now, some of these can do really well and some do not. This is a brand new pair of shoes. I spent $40 on it. I ended up listing these for $79.99 auction and we will see. I don't know if I ever told you guys, um, how I go to the bins and I spend like $14 per item. This is one of the finds that I found there was a Apple computer. This sold for $800 on eBay, but I decided to keep it for myself. So let me see what we got here now. Okay, guys, this I had never heard of before. I uh, have my daughter Emma helping me today with the camera. So Emma, can you look at this? Show them that. I have no idea how to pronounce this. Kuio, who knows? But this is a pretty good brand. I would definitely recommend picking up this brand. I ended up paying $40 for this. And I have them right now. I think I have them for $99 in an auction. I like to do auctions because sometimes things, pe people get into bidding wards and they can go really high. Okay. The next item I have, can you show them that, Emma? That is some Dr. Martens, and this is a really good style here. This is a Sinclair. I paid $40 for those, and I have them up for $150 right now. I'll show you what they look like. This is a good style to get, 40 bucks. So hopefully that will sell. I did sell a pair of Dr. Martens recently. I think I sold them for like 120 or 140 and I paid $40 for those. All right. The next item I have is a brand new North Face jacket. This jacket retails for $1.99. It's messed up here. I paid $40 for it and I have it listed right now for $100. So I'll make $50 profit if it sells. One has sold before of that. Okay. The next item I have is this pair of limbs shoes, men's shoes. I went to a church sale recently and I paid $3 for these shoes. I had them up on an auction for $24.99. And I have some watchers right now, so I'm not sure how high they will go. But for $3, I thought that was a good buy. Okay. This item here, I bought for $14 at the bin store. You know where they have everything on Fridays is $14. And this does pretty well. I have it listed right now for $125. So if that sells, that will be a good profit. Okay. I got these at that church sale for $3. How do you say it? Chaco, Chaco? <laughs> I don't know. I just know the ice cream ones that they stopped um, selling. But I have these right now 
for $29.99 in an auction. And this is kind of interesting right here. If you look here on the back of them, you can see this. This means men's, the sizing, and this dot means it's the normal width. If you have a slash mark, I believe that means more wide foot. So that's, that's where you find the sizing for these shoes. Okay. I s listed this yesterday. It's brand new. It was at that Amazon $14 a day place and um, on Fridays. And the box is kind of damaged, but I looked inside and it's brand new. And I put it up for $80 free shipping. I paid $14 and it sold. So I need to pack this item. I just listed it yesterday too. So that was a really fast sell. Okay. The next item I got says $5, but there was a 50% markup at the church sale if you came earlier. So really I paid $7.50 for these. It's a bunch of Ninja Turtles. I really don't know too much about it. I think they're like later model, maybe 2018 when I looked up some of them. I have them on an auction right now. And I think I started them out either $24.99 or um, $29.99. So I kind of, I don't know. I didn't want to take the time to like individually look at each item. It's just so time consuming and I'd rather just sell them all in one go and be done with it. So that's what I decided to do with those. All right. I paid $20 for these. They're brand new. Um, I put them up for $75 free shipping. So if those sell, that'll be a good price. And you know, right now it's starting to warm up, so maybe they will sell. All right. Next item I have is these Hoka's and they're massive. They're huge. I think they're a size 15. I paid $40 for these. I put them up for a hundred. So I think this will be a slow sell because they're so big and it takes the right kind of buyer, but I think eventually they will sell. So I went ahead and got them. Um, I paid, I got two pairs of these. They're just different sizes. Tevas. They look like this. I paid $20 a piece for these and I listed them for $50 with shipping. Okay, the next item I have is this Noko Genius. I think I told you guys I was a little apprehensive of selling this brand because, you know, one time I had a, someone said it didn't work, but this one looked brand new. It was still in this box and I listed it yesterday and it sold already. It sold for $80 with free shipping and I paid $14 for that. So that was good. Here is another item that I got on Friday um, for $14. It's a little microphone. I never heard of this brand, um, but I looked it up and the comps were pretty good on it. I listed this for $70. All right. Keep them moving. And I have, I don't know if you guys have ever seen this brand, Bauerfein. It's made in Germany. And I paid $14 a piece for these. And I have them listed right now for $75 each. I think I have a lister, a watcher on one of them. So hopefully those will sell. It might take a little while. And I may not get $75, but even if I got like $60, i would be happy with that. Because I didn't put a lot of money into it. All right, this is an item I got at the church sale. I paid three dollars for it. I currently have it listed for sixty. It's brand new. Like if you go to these church sales or even like thrift stores, which I don't really have time to do lately, but CDs, um, sometimes like random movies that you wouldn't even think of can be worth a lot of money. Like, I mean, $60 is pretty good, I think, for that. All right, and 
this is my second pair of this brand that I've bought. I have no clue where it's from. La Rude, La Raud, I'm not sure how to say it. This kind of reminds me of Clueless. I don't know if you've seen that 1990s movie, um, but I grew up on that and I think I have these up for 120. This brand I feel like is a slow seller, but I paid $40 for that. So I thought that was a good find. Um, all right, here is one of my fails, you know, I'm not going to just show you guys all the good stuff. You know, sometimes I make mistakes and this is one I paid $40 for these. They're nice, right? But I didn't look over them good enough. What's wrong with this picture, Emma? Do you notice what's missing? You can say it's like the, little the white buckle. buckle yeah, thing. it's missing a buckle. So if you guys have a way that I can find this missing buckle, leave a comment because I would like to repair this because I spent $40 on these and if I can't repair this, that's just a total loss. Does that little side because have a I, buckle? Yeah, the other side has a buckle, but I didn't pay attention. Um. That's what happens sometimes. Okay. And the last <clears throat> item we have, Emma, is this jacket. A little bit of fluff on it, the heart, so I'll have to go over it with the um, lint roller when it sells. This one here, it's a Storm Defender jacket. I paid $14 for it, and um, yeah, I think I, I listed this one for $75. So I'm sure it's worth more than that, but I just I don't like to keep all this stuff and. I have a lot of money invested recently. I've been spending like, I don't know, like last week I spent $700 just in one place. I spent $200 on Friday. Um, yeah, I've been spending a lot of money. But that's it for now. That's what I listed in the past couple days. I should have really listed more, but it's really time consuming. I've been busy and I will try to get out another video soon. Bye.